Hello everyone, Katie Wheeler, your remote instruction coordinator here, today talking about building polls in Zoom. Building a poll in Zoom is easy to do. You could do a multiple choice or single choice question, and you can do this during a meeting, build it in advance, whatever works best for you. I highly recommend not doing this during a classroom session. It can get a little hectic. It is nice to have it built ahead of time. When you're ready to build your poll, you'll go down to your meeting options here and select polls. If you don't see polls, you need to head to your settings and turn that option on. Once the polls come up, you can then add a question and it's actually going to pull up the poll creator in your browser. And so I'm going to show you that here, exactly what it looks like. So in my browser, I've got my question that I can ask, what is your favorite type of ice cream? I'm typing terribly today. And you could have the chocolate, the strawberry, uh, vanilla as your options. You can also select to have anonymous answers to the polls, otherwise it will use the names of the respondents or participants in your meeting. Once you have all your questions prepared, you can select save. This will bring the poll up during your meeting. So if I go back to my polls, I can now see the questions that I have set up. I can launch the poll and my participants will be able to see it, respond to it, and then you can see those reactions live. You can choose whether you share the results with participants or if you just keep the information to yourself. And then of course you want to make sure you close out that polling feature before you go on to the next step. If you want to build your polls in Zoom in advance, you simply navigate to your meeting. And once you schedule the meeting, you can scroll to the bottom where you have the poll. You can add, the feature looks the exact same so you just start to enter in your questions and answers, and then when you pull up the poll during your Zoom meeting, it'll pop up and already be built for you. That is my overview of building polls in Zoom. It's quick and easy. You can also do this in WebEx or using Poll Everywhere. If you have any questions, you can reach me at remote.instruction at ppcc.edu.